Hey, what's good, y'all? We're back in the cut with Baki Hama, season two, episode 27. Taste of Dad. Um, yeah, interesting title, but uh, yeah, like I said in the last uh few episodes, I'm just ready for this to wrap up, and finally, I'm assuming it's gonna wrap up with, the, with this episode. And um, yeah, we have the finale now, so it's good to know. Um, yeah, I mean, last episode was just I don't even know how to ex- that was just. You just gotta watch it for yourself, bro. Like that episode, I don't, ridiculous. Um, but here we are, and um, we're gonna see if Yujiro wins, if Baki wins. At this point, not really a fight, you know. It's just a, uh, yeah, what they call it, a harmony or whatever. I don't know, man. But whatever, bro. We here, twenty-seven. Let go. Pictograph. Bro, what is this? <laughs> what the heck is this? All right, before you get into all this stuff. So basically, I'm assuming these pictographs, or whatever they were like, it's it's obviously showcasing usual on Baki, right, and the spectator crowd, or whatever. But like, is this something that's been happened in history before? Like, or it's happened a long time before and now it's happening again? Is that why he's saying this isn't a continuation and, or it's, and it's not a new beginning? Is that why he's saying that or is this, I don't know, is he just talking? Mm. What, did he ever really teach Baki? I remember that, but okay. Mm. You spit him, low key. I like this. Charlie, I'm a funny bro. A test of masculinity. Who's this? So they did move up. Get these two out of here, bro. This show is a freaking comedy, bro. Yeah, well, anytime now. Damn, what the heck? <laughs> you took that dude's whole chin off. Oh, this is Yujiro. Oh, okay. You know, there's like, there's like, this is, there's like deeper themes you can take from this, right? But at this point, I'm just like, I'm just done with it. <laughs> you feel me? Like this is, <laughs> bro, like wrap it up. Dang, bro. This is crazy. Imagine he'd do them like them all.
Just let it in, bro. <laughs> Just let this thing in, man. Nah, man. We're not letting this slide, bro. <laughs> this ain't it, bro. <laughs> this is ridiculous. What is this? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Why are y'all still watching? What the heck? <laughs> Some Naruto Sasuke stuff. They don't even got to talk to communicate. Oh my gosh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Come on, man! <laughs> Come on, man! This is this is this is. Come on! Good as new. Okay. I guess he got a good surgery or something. Oh, thank God. That didn't take too long. The end. Y'all, end the show. <laughs> yeah, for real. Let's be for real, man. This show could end right here. Oh, there's some more. God dang it. <laughs> they could honestly end the show right here, bro. And just end it. Because after this, bro, it's already over for me, if I'm being honest, bro. I know there's some more with like this whole, I think like this, this samurai or sword dude or whatever, who's supposed to like be another, like a pickle opponent or whatever. Listen, man, this show ended for me right here. <laughs> if I'm being honest. Um, so I was thinking about rescue too. I think we're going to get some rescue at the end right here, but like, bro, I don't even care about that right now. <laughs> Oh, he beat this dude. Oh, sorry. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Ooh. Hey, sure. Good. Cool. Congratulations, bro. Like, all right, man. Hey, let's try to loop it. Listen, man. We listen. <laughs> There's a lot to say about this, man, but I'm, I'm going to try to keep it a little brief. Um,. All right, finally, this, uh, how long was this, bro? This started, like, in, it started, it started, like, in episode, well, episode 20, 21? So, six episodes since, since this fight started, you feel me, um, until its end. Maybe it's, like, y'all gotta understand, too, maybe, like, if I was watching this, dolo and not reacting to it it'll be different and i'll just be able to watch it and be like haha but like <laughs> watching something this silly bro and like this ridiculous is, is just like it's annoying it gets annoying at times you feel me and um yeah i'm kind of done with baki bro i'm being honest with you at least as far as reacting goes yeah <laughs> for sure but uh hey man this show it definitely i i've accepted the fact that it's i think they've taken a different turn to it like with baki hama especially this season it's now, um, it's a, I did a poll where I was like, yo, what genre is Baki? Cause I kind of wanted to gauge like what people thought. Is it like a sports uh, anime? Is it a, is it a comedy anime or is it like an action anime? And like most of y'all, like 80% I think said like an action anime. And at that point to me, like I, I asked the question, but like to me it's already, it's, to me it's a comedy. It's a com it's an action comedy, but it's way more comedy <laughs> at this point. It's way more comedy than it is action, bro. 
so many different scenes, bro, throughout this fight. This episode alone, I don't even, like, I had no words, bro. <laughs> I had, like, no words for most of this episode because it was just, I just had enough of it, man. But, um, yeah, I mean, Baki, he's now the strongest, I guess that's, you know what I'm saying, what he was after. And Yujiro won the battle, or, or Baki gave the victory to him. Cool, man. But, like, this was, this was all, like, just... You know, like, I feel like once Baki's whole purpose of, like, not trying to avenge his mother, once that, like, just got thrown out the window, I think that's when they just said, all right, yeah, we just gonna do whatever. Because it's like, okay, Baki, he don't care about avenging his mother anymore. He said it was to, he wanted to, um, not avenge her, but, like, something about, like, uh, making her proud or something like that. I don't know. But whatever it was, it didn't even seem like it was about that. He, <laughs> no, like, thought of Baki in his mind was like, oh, yeah, my mom. Nothing like that, bro. <laughs> all of this man had way more love and admiration for Yujiro than his mom. And, I mean, that was very clear. Even though he said, yo, I'm going to fight him to to do this for the... He, he didn't do... It, he didn't care about none of that, for real. Um, the whole thing with Yuichiro, that was random. That was just thrown in the freaking mix. I mean, that was unnecessary. I don't think we needed that, but they threw it in there, right? Same thing with these freaking, these, uh, these ancient, uh, freaking stone things, bro. Like, what's up with that? <laughs> Why did they include that, bro? What was that? We didn't even get a true understanding of what that was. That's what I'm saying. The show was a freaking joke. It's, it's like, if you, if you go into it knowing like, oh yeah, this is going to be humorous and comedy, then it's cool. But like, just to get switched like that was kind of annoying because honestly, Baki was funny. It had funny moments, but it was mainly action based. Even like in Baki Hama, you had freaking the prisoners, the Rasha tournament, especially the tournament. That was dope. Action focus, bro. It had comedy moments in there, but it was like mainly about like the martial art aspect of it. It was cool. <laughs> After that, bro, it just, they just switched it up, bro. Especially with this whole, this, this thing right here, man. This is ridiculous. Um yeah man i feel like i think i i like the whole baki the grappler concept more than i think baki hama but hey man to each his own you feel me to each his own some people really like you know the comedy um shows or anime like that that's not my biggest favorite um genre in the world <laughs> you feel me especially when it comes to anime i'm cool on the comedy aspect of it unless you're going to include it like in a good way or like in a minimal kind of aspect to it but um when it's like it feels like they kind of just it overshadowed all of the action in the anime, I feel like. With Baki, so much of this joking and comedy and like ridiculousness to me just overshadows the whole martial arts aspect of it. The the deeper themes, because there are deeper themes that they did throw in there, which I thought was like interesting, but like I couldn't even like really appreciate it because it was too it was too it was too ridiculous, bro. Like everything else was just too freaking comedical. And to me it's just like, man, I'm done with it. But that's my little rant, I guess. I don't know. But um, they didn't need to stretch this part out this long, in my opinion. Um, 27 episodes, bro, <sighs> of this, bro, is like, yo, that's ridiculous. Um, but finally, <laughs> got through it. Uh, Red suit. We saw him at the end. I'm glad we didn't have to really uh see. I mean, I was, I kind of wanted to see him and Bolt fight. I wanted to see that a little bit. But like after that, after Yujiro's whole stuff with Baki, I was kind of done with it. So I'm glad they just kind of skipped that and just let us know Retsu beat him. Retsu's happy that he was able to utilize Kung Fu without, or like utilize Kung Fu and the limitations of boxing. So, listen, <laughs> it's a joke. <laughs> it's a joke, bro. Like they just doing stuff, man. And it's just kind of like, it's cool to watch that he just watching it, bro. But it's like, when you out here like reacting to it, bro, it's kind of like, yo, what is this? Uh, animation, I'm not gonna lie, animation's been good uh quality stuff even like i think i think it was this episode or last episode but like there was a, a nice like boost in animation and like one of the scenes but it's been very consistent throughout the whole bakihama series i think that's what's really grabbed the attention of like many into baki is animation because baki the grappler i think early 2000s maybe 90s like his animation jump was you know what i'm saying from that to this crazy but uh if we being honest bro story wise like it's not even close like baki the grappler that story wasn't too insane but it was still like i feel like more cohesive and made sense compared to what this is um but yeah man it just many things i could i could kind of go into bro i, I kind of touched based on the overall uh or my overall i guess thoughts 
on this show in this season. And that's that's cool, man. It's, it is what it is, man. I'm just glad we got through it. Um, and yeah, that that was the end of the 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 great father son do freaking battle, whatever you want to call it, man. And uh, yeah, that's that's it is what it is, man. Um, I'm just glad we got King and Ashura, bro. <laughs> For all y'all who who, who into Baki and y'all haven't seen King and Ashura, highly recommend it. Uh, to me, it's a much better show. Um, and I think. I like Baki. I like I like the the first parts, um, like season one and the Rasa tournament. You know what I'm saying of Baki, but like this whole pickle stuff, I feel like people really put on a level where it was like supposed to be this grand thing. And to me, pickle stuff was not even like that that amazing. Like it was cool. Like people would hype and pickle up so crazy, but it was like almost once we got the the premise of it, it was kind of like alright, bro. And then you know we never got to see Yujiro on pickle. Many things, bro. <laughs> I'm raining. I'm, I'm rambling on, bro. But I'm just saying, like, this is just how I feel about it. But either way, man, uh, Baki Hama, that concludes it. And uh, we done, man. So do all the stuff down below. Your boy Dominion, checking out. Catch you on the next. Stay healthy. Stay powerful. Stay blessed.